well, both me and my brother live in the States, so we wanted to do Philippine weddings because my brother was saying earlier that if he were to do a double wedding, um, it would be with me. And so now it's coming true for both of us now. We are getting married today. Yeah, we're both getting married. Not to today. each other. <laughs> JR, I'm really excited to, to be here and to join the family and to have a celebration with you and Angela. So you guys are really cool and you're my older brother. Now. Really? Yeah. Uh, we met in ice cream tasting. So it was second semester of freshman year of college. And um, I was volunteering for an event that ice cream tasting and he was, um, he attended. And then from there we were in a similar events group where we planned events for the university. So we would see each other all the time there. I went off to optometry school and we were long distance for a little while. One time I came back and I was really bogged down from all the classwork and stuff. And, it was a family event. I just remember, I think I, I told her then, I was like, I want to marry you. competitions, Livonia Meyer, and living less than two miles away from each other for over 12 years, I've loved watching you transition from a stranger to someone I can't imagine experiencing life without. And if there's anything I've learned from you, it's that I can be myself and still be loved. Jessica, ever since we, f we first started dating six years ago, I spent almost every day as a student. From undergraduate to optometry school, you have always been by my side. Because so much time was spent as poor college students, we had to be a little more creative with our dates. We went on long walks on campus to talk about our days, walking the most roundabout way or past our destination to make sure we got everything in. Jessica, she's like one of the most energetic people I know, that's for sure. Um, she's always smiling. She's got a really, really pretty smile too, really warm smile. Home has always had so many meanings to me. Whether it was the Philippines or Michigan or Washington, it's always dependent on the context and who I was talking with. But now home is a singular thing, my safe space and biggest adventure. It's you. It's always been you, James, even if I didn't know it. And I'll always continue being you. And that's something that I'm sure of. The past six years have been excellent. I'm looking forward to the next 60 plus. I just can't wait to keep doing new things with you, traveling with you, but also doing just the normal things like making dinner and going on walks at night with you and stuff. So really looking forward to it. Mahal kita.
together and forget all the little details, I know we'll remember the feelings. The happiness that people write about. The smiles that are so big they hit your face. The laugh so deep you can feel them in your abs the next day. I look forward to today and every day with you. Forever and ever. The end.